Hi everybody, welcome back to Tampedix White Magic Spells. Let's see what are the messages today. A lot of you do not know I have another channel. So I have Time Predicts also. This one is my second channel because I wanted to do spells and love readings. Something fell out of my hand. Please let me pick it up. Okay, this fell out of my hand. Check out my other reading. I said four days don't do anything much if your relationship is not going well. Do not, uh, you know, send crazy messages to each other anymore. Uh, the relationship is going to heal, okay, no matter what. So we start with uh, a beautiful give and take of love and a beautiful equal balanced relationship. A relationship where you feel equally for each other, you do things equally for each other. The responsibility of running a relationship is not on one person. And I think it's come through... Um, some kind of a tower moment you could have given each other you know which was needed in the relationship so the uh, so the universe did put you apart or something had to happen you know to realize the importance of the other one to teach i'm going to say teach a lesson because sometimes it's important not in a bad way but sometimes it, it it's uh, needed to realize that hey you know what are you doing you're losing uh, the person you know you're just being uh, i just saw one 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 that time <laughs> so you're losing the person you know uh, by not giving them importance by taking them for granted it has to be equal all the time it has to be you both have to keep working in a relationship even if you're seeing each other for two months two years more than two years five years it has to be love that has to flow from both the sides equal okay two is also equal two pillars in a relationship equally putting in effort i'm getting equal equal word maybe you use the word equal something to do with equal rights but i don't know i'm getting equal so both of you have to put equal uh you know love effort care understanding it can't be one person is compromising and adjusting and the other person does nothing you could be a leo you could be dealing with a leo i'm getting a water sign i'm also getting a, like almost like the amnesty sign it could be you're a doctor or a nurse or the person you are with is a doctor or a nurse you know that's another thing i get You could have got boots, brown boots recently, ordered them. I saw, uh, which one did I see? Yeah, Knight of Wands, I think. Okay, these two fell on, on my lap. What's happening? I mean, the uh, cards in this one are flying everywhere. And this is beautiful. See, magician, things are going to be right. The universe is telling you, you know, I'm doing, I'm putting it right. And I did mess it up, you know. You guys need to understand. And uh, even in the other one, it was like manifesting big time, you know, and uh, leaving it on the universe that if things are not going right, please restore the balance. It's more like a balance, you know. Somebody's coming forward next. I mean, this July, before July ends, things are going to be good. You could be definitely dealing with a water sign. This is cancer. So if things have not been like really uh, good in the emotional front, if one person is not expressing or not talking much, they do not talk about their feelings, everything is kept inside. Uh, universe is going to tell them it's time to let your feelings out. Okay. Look at the two pillars. Look at, you know, how yin and yang, uh, you know, are its balance. You've got everything going in the relationship you know everything good going in the relationship so why spoil it you know you guys have uh, you know um, uh, you've tick marked everything that you wanted in in a partner in a in a love interest and uh, and just uh, make things right i mean you've got everything uh, going and like if it in any way if uh, the relationship in the relationship uh, something happened and you know when one wheel is not there in a car or you know chariot it can't really move properly you know so it came to a stop maybe one person had stopped putting in effort and the other person had to give the other person a, a tower moment or something to think about you know that hey you know think about what you're doing to me a lot of times people just keep doing uh, wrong because I think it's it's normal you know one person is putting in effort so they keep staying there you know but this person also gets tired you know this is you you got tired and this person is just here not moving forward so you're like how much time effort you know you start feeling drained out so it is for the other person to think something about it okay that what am I doing why is this relationship not balanced or why am I not putting effort what have I done you know what should I do it everything is right in the relationship why am I spoiling it you're getting some news communication next seven hours seven days next four days are extremely important what I said in the other one seems like a fine balance it's it's them you know thinking that what went wrong a lot of times the other person like I said is not thinking 
this is hey you know look at this look at what all love i've gathered from there and what all love they sent it to me and what am i doing one of you have to stop and think what's wrong maybe it was you maybe were you being over obsessive about the relationship you were being uh, insecure totally you know or just pushing them in a way that things of uh, the wheel you know with this uh, card i'm getting the wheel came out and this is how you know when the wheel comes out uh, the chariot whatever it is goes really out of balance half hearted effort you know i'm getting half hearted effort one of you were like putting half hearted effort in it totally you could have got a new belt studded belt something to do with studs yeah you love each other you value each other it's it's impo it's important you know but is one of you is just getting mean or getting you know over possessive look at this is it making you insecure because you're getting over possessive over jealous so remember that you know if if you're doing that if you're becoming over possessive it's also going to spoil the balance of the relationship guys this is a sign of creativity empress pretty much in the power in her own power queen commanding everything joy you could be planning a baby you guys were planning a baby but what happened you know something happened so this is replan i feel a replanning replan about the future or re or talk you know rethink what's happening what wrong is happening somewhere it's about thinking you know introspection that what am i doing wrong also it's not about just the other person are you doing something wrong you've got everything going in the relationship guys what happened you know this is this is magic this is the magician you know universe has given you a beautiful uh, love interest a uh, wonderful lover so what's happened where did you falter where did the other person fall yeah, you know falter look at this somewhere you know going towards being good something happened was was the other person closed or were you closed were not happy i feel over reacting yeah were you becoming you were complaining too much every time there's a complaint and you were not noticing the good that is happening in a relationship is that you or is that them one of you is you know doing this it was moving towards a beautiful relationship and it is beautiful look at this getting married settling having kids you know having an extended family everybody staying together i feel like a country home you know going to visit there you bought another home far away i get the word castle i get the word chess i don't know if you play chess or they play chess yeah look at this this needs a beginning a new beginning or death also means death of things that you know are spoiling the relationship from your side or the other person's side i mean universe has to address that you have to address it they have to address it i mean and there is victory on its way this is wands this is passion for each other fire all things are going right for you guys i mean i feel uh, you you either you moving towards spoiling something you know when we have this thing that wow everything is going good i am sure this is going to go wrong and oh wow they're so happy they always calling me i'm sure they have someone else you know now all the all those thoughts are either building in your head or their head so don't spoil something so good it's actually victory in a relationship things being right you were in a victory march i mean you both were doing so well balanced what happened is it in introspection time you ha you guys have to think let me just pull out some more cards just let me take out cards and see spirit guides please give me a few messages that are important spirit guides please give me a few messages Look at this guys reunion what did i say so important whatever you did to the situation you know reunion is in the other channel also sudden call or text sudden call or text that will make you happy feeling stuck are you feeling stuck is the other person not understanding give give them time explain it to them okay because you've got a wonderful relationship explain talk a lot of things are solved uh, with communication this is your lucky card so the you're going to feel lucky in some way trust issues see maybe there are trust issues with each other or one person has trust issues feeling lonely 
because they are your counterpart and you feel lonely without them they they are your lover past is past somewhere cut the past okay or don't think about past fights or do not bring up past fights they will express their feelings i'm not leaving you look at this i'm not leaving you at the end of the deck let's see this also you will receive a text soon a text which will make you happy two cards from this spirit guides please give me two cards from this let's give our relationship another chance see reunion chances i can commit right now so this was the uh, thing that could have uh, put it off balance the relationship and you thought oh they've said i can't commit right now they're not they're not in love with me maybe they needed more time you mean the world to me i want to be with you there's a want so commitment will come okay maybe you have to talk maybe they just said i can't commit now and you thought hey they don't love me they hate me this 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 maybe they need a little more time yeah so such beautiful messages guys take care and i'll be back for another reading bye guys